Hello there, welcome back to uh, the next episode. Yep. We are binging this game down. Between episodes, went back, got some pictures. Also looked up some stuff, because there are some questions I had. So I had to looking up some things. So you can't get nine tails in this game, unfortunately. Which is a shame, because that would have been a really awesome one. In terms of Clefairy is not in it as well, that's kind of interesting. That one I actually uh, was pretty sure of. Yeah. But we found out how to get Gyarados, who I was positive you could get, but I couldn't remember how. So hopefully we'll be getting that, you know, sometime during this playthrough. We just, you know, got the number of points, so I think he should be getting us the pester balls right now. Yeah. There it is. God, PETA must hate this game even... Actually, PETA must hate this game less than the other games, or more. He's throwing objects at innocent Pokemon. Oh, great, I accidentally hit repeat. Uh-oh. Okay, go, of course. It's so, every gamer's nightmare. We're going to the river, yes. because we gotta get the alternate path. Yeah. Which just can't be gone without the pest rolls. So we can sneak a much better photo of the slope up here as well. Yeah. Yeah, the little spike looks like a nose. That's actually on the back. Hmm. The front is actually the part that curves around. So for the longest time, I thought smelt was like the nose was. Oh, there he is. Unfortunately, I can't get it, though, because that just cuts you know, I missed the other ones. Yeah. I got distracted by... Things. Yeah. And now we fall off there and die. Yep, rest in peace, Gerald. Well done. <laughs> okay. 
Well done. Not being you were close. So good. Yeah, definitely. Well done. Sweet. Yay. He doesn't even acknowledge that Slowbro's waving. Yeah. Is there something against Slowbro? Well done. I don't know. Hey, what do you think would happen if a slow uh, poke was to get bitten on the head and the arse at the same time by um, Shelter? Which is supposedly, according to the anime, how it evolves into a slow king. The head. I kind of want to know, to be honest. Uh, I don't know how it would work, actually. Yeah! Yes! Do uh something like that. Make it where I think Slowpoke normally evolves at level 40. Mm -hmm. Make it where it has to be level 40. And holding the king's rock. Uh, or maybe just make it hold the king's rock. And when it hits level 40, it must evolve. And at that time, it will uh, evolve into a new evolution. I don't know what, how it would work. But uh, my aim is horrible. I'd almost get rid of the entire uh, water type alone, almost really rock psychic. Which would be kind of weird, but with that exterior shell like that. But it, it would have sky high defenses, I think. There. Yep, all the Bulbasaurs in this level are non-packed Bulbasaurs. They are all dittos. Yeah. Are we going to rest the same as Jiggly Puff? I should make sure of about anything, it can be fun. Yeah. Forgot, are these the OG Jinx? Yep. Nice. That face. Actually, something I found interesting too was that in uh, the Golden Silver Virtual Console, mm -hmm. they actually uh, replaced the uh, the Japanese Jinx sprites to the, the, the new North American ones. Yep. Because apparently the old one was racist. Yeah, well, they've pretty much, they're trying to erase everything about uh, original Jinx. Like, I get why it's considered racist now, you know, but... You know, not how it was intended, you know. Yeah. Oh, wait, now I remember how I pissed them off. Yeah. Poke flute. There you go. Play over there singing. <laughs> Well, you can also hit one of them and it gets me angry. Fox is another one of those Pokemon that I really didn't like until I started using it. Yeah. And I didn't start using it until I started being here. Oh, really? Yeah. Because I, 
I don't know if you could. I think you, you could get a muck in yellow, but by the time you could, you already had all three starters. If you were like me, you would be using your Pikachu the whole way through. So that's already your first four slots taken up. A lot of times I would have a primate, because that's five. And then yes. my Butterfree usually was replaced by then with uh, at least a Pidgeot. And I just never, there really was no use to have a poison type. Because they were so bad in generation. At least in uh, in the revised gen one, like uh, yellow. Because they were only good against poison there, whereas in the, the original ones, the original gen one was good against bug as well. Wonderful. Mm. Has it been working on bug elite four member? Uh, yes. I gotta pull up his name. He's in gen four, I believe. Yeah. He pretty much made up for Bugsy being uh, one of the worst gym winners because he had a Metapod and a Cocoon on his team. Wonderful. I believe he had Metapod and a Cocoon. Wow. He, had, he sure had a Metapod. Oh. Let's see. Wonderful. There he is. And Bulba P is not working that well. Okay, there we go. His name well, was no, Aaron. Oh, okay. His Diamond and Pearl team is kind of booty. He's got a Dustox and a Beautify. Mm -hmm. but then his final set is Best Quinn, Heracross, and Drapion. Yes. Technically, Dra Drapion should not be on the team mm -hmm. because it's Poison Dark, not Bug. But yeah. it started off as a Bug type. Yeah. His Platinum team is not booty. He's got Yon Mega, a Scizor, and then Best Quinn, Heracross, and Drapion. I was like, okay, so you swapped out Dustox and Beautifly for Yon Mega and Scizor. Mm -hmm. That's the way it should have been. Yeah, I'm just doing a quick run through uh, Volcano because I need one more Pokemon oh, no. to uh, get um, the next area. Oh, yeah. So I think I'll call, we'll call it after um, this, eh? Yeah, I think so. Seriously, these things are just so freaking cute. <laughs> oh, yes, OG Flint. He's a rock type, uh, or he's a fire type uh, Elite Four. He only had two fire type Pokemon. Really? Because in Diamond and Pearl, the only fire type Pokemon that you get were Moltres, were uh, not Moltres, uh, Ponyta and Rapidash, the uh, the Infernape line, and that was it aside from Legendaries. So he had a Rapidash and a Infernape, and he had to give him a Lopunny, Steelix, and a Triplum, all with all with at least one fire type move to justify them. Oh my god. Then in uh, Platinum, oh yeah, and he had to make more. They, he could have had Meg Mordor, I don't know why they didn't give it to him originally. But then in uh, Platinum, they gave him Houndoom, Flareon, Rapidash, and Fernie Bad Meg Mordor. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I never really played Diamond Pearl. You play Platinum, though, right? I play Platinum, yeah. yeah I play Platinum. I pre ordered it so I could get the Giratina little figurine. And I freaking loved it. And then someone knocked it off a shelf, and my dog ate it. I would be triggered. I was heartbroken. Well, it's like my Alduin statue I've got, uh, I'd be pretty triggered if someone broke that. Because the only way you could get that was if you got the special edition Skyrim upon release, like when it originally came out, for like 200 bucks. There we go. There's two uppers. Yeah. Got an upper and a turbo. I kind of wish you could take photos without zooming in. Yeah. Because there's some cases where it's just like, it would be perfect without zooming in. Yeah, I know. Just like that Charizard, I think most of my pictures have been ruined because I have to zoom in. Yeah. And that's just irritating. I always get worried when it only says one picture at first. Mm -hmm. So I always think, like, oh, great, it didn't save any of the others. That's a good ball fix photo. Yeah. I think 
that would be considered perfect ball picks. Because I don't know if you can get a bigger bonus than that 270 for half a one. You probably can. Oh, oh, maybe. There's people who have been paying me, like, try to get these. Wonderful. So I know that, at least for the Charmanders, it only goes up to a certain amount. Wonderful. Wait. Here we go. Let's return to the lab. Welcome back. Welcome back. Alright, so we got the new course of Mocked here. I think we should end it here and reveal the next one next time. I think that'd work out best. Don't want to keep you guys kind of waiting around for too long. Okay, well, thank you for uh, joining us today. Have a oh. Yeah, uh, if you enjoyed it, uh, feel free to leave a like and a comment. And, uh, subscribe is always awesome. Yeah, let us know. Are you enjoying anything? If there's anything uh, you'd like to suggest for us to do, maybe anything you would change, any nostalgic memories you've got. I think that uh, about wraps it up. Okay, so hopefully you'll join us next time.